Hello and welcome to the Chicory's Maintenance Video Series. Over the last three videos, you've seen me work a lot on this six kilowatt generator. And um, I wanna show you the last step, which is adding information to our maintenance log database. I use the HandyBase database as the foundation for my maintenance log. And I love it because I can run it on my iPads and I can also sync it to my Mac. It's multi-platform, so if you're not an Apple person, that's fine. It'll work great for you. Let me show you how I use HandyBase in tracking everything on Chicory. I maintain 23 databases keeping track of all the maintenance and stuff I need to do aboard Chicory. I know that sounds a little bit overwhelming, but the software is so easy to use that this amount of databases is not an issue at all and actually helps me speed the process. So let me give you a quick example of how this works. You can see right here I'm going to select 6 kilowatt from the database because I want to make an entry. Once I'm in my selected database, I just simply click the Add Record button. The software then brings me to my customized Add Record screen, which I built for this 6 kilowatt. I have it auto-fill the date for me automatically. Now I'm going to add an action performed, and that's simply done by clicking on the drop-down. I've chosen to make this field a drop-down just because there's so many things that you do on a boat that are repetitive. Like an example, this isn't the first time that I've replaced a belt on the 6 kilowatt, so the first time I did it, I added it to the database. Once I select the action performed, I simply fill in the number of hours on the unit and then make any notes that I think are necessary. And I finish up by clicking on the Save button. This takes me back to the original database and I can see my new entry there at the bottom. I'm going to share a couple things I like about HandyBase in addition to the simple database functionality. I'm going to show this off in the Watermaker Log area. You'll notice that all the items within the database are blue at the top. If you simply click on that, it gives you a bunch of different functions. Besides the ease of sorting the database with the ascending or descending buttons, I love the report functionality and I'm going to show you how that works. You simply click on the Run Report button and a report is presented to you that uh, is pre-formatted and you don't have a lot of flexibility in changing the report, but here's what it says. I've run my water maker 372 times in total. I've made 33,479.97 gallons in that amount of time. And on average, I make 89.99 gallons each time I make water. I want to share one more of the database with you, which I think is pretty cool. So it's our engine room check. And every hour we're underway, at the top of the hour, we add a new record to this list. So every hour underway, we look at the Maritron system. Obviously, the date autofills. We fill in the time, the RPM, speed, engine hours, engine temp, oil pressure, volts, fuel vacuum, engine temperature, outside temperature, stabilizer temperature, transmission temperature, stuffing box temperature, keel cooler temperature, exhaust stack temperature, how much fuel we have, the ocean temperature, our heading, and our closest location, and finally an odometer reading. This has been super helpful because if we're underway and we see that our stabilizers are running at 148 degrees and we think, wow, is that warm? I can look at the database and see that, oh yeah, normally when the water temperature is 85 degrees and the outside temperature is above 90, our stabilizers run at around 146 or 147. So it's really great to make sure that you understand your systems. And in addition, it helps with the preventive maintenance because if I see the engine temperature or something else rising, I can take corrective action and investigate and find out why I'm falling outside of the norms. Well, I'm guessing you get the idea. Thanks a lot for viewing this video, commenting, liking, and subscribing. See you next week.